Hey everyone, my name is Jessica and I'm here with Dr. Bacon for another Breakfast with Bacon session. And these are so fun to do. Yeah, they you are. Know? We just get to hang out and chat about cool health things. So this month we're talking about detoxification. So we talked about avoiding toxins and now we talk about why do we even need to detoxify? Don't our livers do that on a regular basis? Yeah, and they do. And I think, you know, and there's some people are saying that your body doesn't detoxify. I mean, it detoxifies, but there's no real reason to help support them or push them. When we, when you understand the concept of what we're trying to deal with, mm -hmm. when the body's bombarded chronically with these toxins in the environment or in the foods or whatever we're eating, or even emotional toxins, right? Sure. There's so many of them. So when you start to have this on a regular basis, the body has to work through it. And literally, we don't say that just eliminating the food mm -hmm. is adequate. Really what you need to do is while you're eliminating yeah. the food is support those glands or organs that detoxify. And that's when you give it the vitamins and nutrients that it needs to help the process work through that detoxification. And that's how you get more effective detoxification versus just, I'm just going to avoid food and fast. Yeah. Which can help to a degree, but if yeah. the organ is still functioning the same, it's not going to detoxify well. Yeah. And you're, even though you've avoided the foods, you're still dealing with everything else that's in the environment oh, too. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So that's the key is really try to support it when mm -hmm. it goes that route. So then how do we do that? How do we improve that detoxification process? Yeah, and, and it's perfect. So there's three things we're going to talk about today. Like, One of them is going to be about really good water intake, right? Yeah. And filtration of the water to make sure. Even if you drink bottled water, mix up the bottled water. Mm -hmm. The body's really impressive. It can handle small amount of toxins, even on a regular basis, if it can deal with different toxins. Right. If it gets the same thing over and over, and they're you know on a regular basis, the body it gets bogged down and can't handle it as well. Mm -hmm. So I just say, even every spring water is going to have some sort of toxins in it. Yeah. And you can't avoid everything. So paying attention to that would be change up the water bottles and then a filtration system. Yeah, why is tap use. water not okay? Oh boy, wow. So that tap is water is probably not good for the body because remember, think about it. Everything that's going into you or into anybody else or any kind of medical or any kind of drugs or anything like that is going into the water filtration system and then it's being pumped back into all of us through lead pipes and everything else and collecting mm -hmm. things as it goes through. Yeah. So even water filtration systems may not be adequate enough to get even pharmacological drugs mm, out of scary. the water. So we may all be on Prozac yeah. and not even know it. So anyway, so that's where the tap water, I don't think yeah. it's like, just be careful with what you're putting in. If you're gonna do it, I would make sure we kind of put some sort of water filtration in. Yeah, there. and if so. you have any questions about which one to choose for your, your needs, let us know, we're happy yeah. to help. Yeah, and then the other one we're gonna talk about is... Exercise. Yeah, exercise, mm -hmm. which is a great thing, right? We wanna get the body moving, so it helps that lymphatic system oh, drain, drain. Its, uh, yeah, yes. drain the toxins, drain the breakdown out of the body, out, mm -hmm. so it's moving and mobilizes it, so it gets out of the system. And two food things. One, of course, is going to be supplementation that Doc will talk mm -hmm. about in a second. But first, some really good practical foods to help detoxify the liver specifically or just kind of the overall system. Beets are really great. Mm -hmm. We've got great recipes, so don't be scared of the beets. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lemon juice in your water first thing empty your stomach in the yeah, morning. morning is really mm -hmm. great. Any dark leafy green is going to yeah. really pump some good stuff into that liver for you. Yeah, and we're talking yes, about it too. Uh, Livco would be another product that we use on a regular basis. And then we do an SP cleanse. We do a cleanse. You know, we try to do a cleanse quarterly, mm -hmm. pretty much. It's very easy. We do a big one every January that we kind of roll through. And we have a big group of people doing it. It's just that once a year, really good push. And yes, if it's not the detox that really makes the big difference, it's the support of the nutrition in there yeah. to help that body detoxify and allow it to work better. So mm -hmm. I hope that gives you a couple of things to take away. Thank yeah, you. yeah, thank you. So we appreciate you guys paying attention. Share this with your friends. If you have any questions or comments, please write them below. Give us a thumbs up. Let us know what you're thinking. Yeah. And of course, we'll see you on the next Breakfast with Bacon. Thank you guys.